The Griffin Bruxellois Brussels Griffin is a breed of toy dog named for their city of origin, Brussels, Belgium. The Griffin Bruxellois may refer to three different breeds, the Griffin Bruxellois, the Griffin Belge and the Petit Brabancon. Identical in standard, except for coat and color differences, and some standards they are considered varieties of the same breed, much like Belgian Shepherd dogs. The Petit Brabancon is a miniature companion dog with large expressive eyes and active lively facial expressions. This breed is distinguished from the Belgian and Brussels Griffins by the absence of a beard on the face and shorter hair. Brabancon has a calm, but at the same time proud disposition, and obeys only his master and his family members. Despite its small size, it is a strong dog with strong bones, agile and at the same time graceful in movement. By its nature, the Brabant Griffin is alert and courageous, he is definitely not one of the timid. Highlights Petit Brabankin has a well-balanced character, he will never throw himself at animals or passers-by without reason. The Brabant Griffin is curious, sociable and playful. The pet gets along well with young children, positively perceives pranks, and does not take offense at the owners for a long time. The four-legged natives of Brabant quickly get used to the families they live in, and this attachment is forever. Prolonged separation from the owners can injure their delicate psyche, therefore, if possible, it is better to take griffins with you on trips. As they grow up, the Petit Brabankins do not lose their puppy playfulness, remaining in the soul of children. Representatives of the breed are very sociable and charming dogs. They love to be in the spotlight all the time. The developmental level of a small Brabankin roughly corresponds to the intelligence of a three-year-old child. This means that the dog responds well to training and in the future retains the skills imparted to it. The Brabant Griffin gets along with any animals in the house. Petit Brabankin subtly senses the mood of its owner and adjusts to it like a true companion. If the owner is sad, then the Griffin will also be upset, and if it is fun, he will readily share moments of joy. History of the Petit Brabankin breed the distant ancestors of all griffins lived in Europe back in the 15th century. As a result of interbreeding, the griffins became the owners of two types of wool, the Brussels and the Belgian can boast of a coarse coat similar to the hair of the Irish terrier, and the Petit Brabankin, smooth, reminiscent of the coat of a pug. One of the characteristic features of the Brabant griffin is the upturned muzzle. The whole gamut of emotions is easily read from it. The modern Petit Brabankin is a collective image, which contains a little of different breeds. By the way, that very unique muzzle, short, a bit reminiscent of a monkey, is inherited from the German wire hair to Fenpenscher. But this small native of Brabant owes his elegant color to the Cavalier King Charles Spaniel. The new breed so captivated the aristocratic circles, especially the crowned heads, that it quickly gained immense popularity. Its representatives lived in palaces, slept on silk pillows, rode carriages with their high-ranking masters, and even had their own servants. In those distant times, there was not even electricity, not to mention active pastime in our understanding, so the Petit Brabankins entertained their aristocratic masters for hours with fun games and warmed them in their beds on cold nights. Especially the Brabant Griffins were appreciated by single ladies who became disillusioned with a strong field and already desperate to ever meet love. Funny and always positive, these dogs add color to their lives. In addition, the Griffins practically did not leave will on expensive dresses. It was soon noticed that the Petit Brabankins had an unusual feline hobby, to catch small rodents. From that moment on, cheerful companions of single ladies have become indispensable favorites at the courts of the August persons. They were entrusted to protect the royal chambers and carriages from rats and mice. In 1880, the World Dog Show took place in Brussels. Despite the considerable age of the breed, which by this time has already turned two centuries, the Petit Brabankins took part in such an event for the first time. The debut was successful, they won not only an enthusiastic ovation from the audience, but also high marks from the judges. So the breed began its ascent to true fame and recognition. But, as often happens in such cases, the pursuit of profit made its own adjustments. Wanting to sell more individuals, negligent breeders have increased the number to the detriment of the quality of the exterior of the royal dogs. It is not known how the further fate of the Brabant Griffins could have developed if it were not for the Duchess Henrietta Maria Charlotte Antoinette, better known as simply Henrietta of Belgium. She was the eldest daughter of the Count of Flanders Philip of Belgium and his wife Maria Hohenzollern Sigmaringen, niece to King Leopold II of Belgium and sister to King Albert I. At the beginning of the last century, she did a lot to rehabilitate the breed. Thanks to her efforts, the purity of the Petit Brabankins returned to their previous values. After a while, the Belgian authorities allowed the sale of elite puppies abroad. Then World War II broke out, threatening the extinction of many dog breeds, including miniature ones. Unfortunately, the Petit Brabankins were no exception. They were saved from complete disappearance only by the fact that some individuals lived in the UK and the USA. 
After the war, breeders got involved in the restoration of the breed and it was preserved. True, some changes have occurred in its appearance and in the updated design the Brabankins have survived to this day. The breed standard was updated in September 1963 and also in May 2003. The new appearance has become so familiar and loved by fans of the breed that many do not even imagine that small Brabankins look somehow different than today. Petit Brabankin, Description of the Breed Petit Brabankins are small but stocky dogs with strong bones. The height of males and bitches reaches from 16 to 26 cm at the withers, without sexual dimorphism. The weight of a dog, depending on age, ranges from 3 to 6 kg. A small head stands out against the back kilogram surround of the entire body. In fact, relative to the bone, the head is quite large, but due to the flattened muzzle, it looks smaller than it should be. The petit brabankin has a prominent forehead, which makes its profile well defined. A sharp transition from the forehead to the nose is clearly visible. The nose is turned up, the muzzle is short, flattened. These dogs have mobile facial expressions, which is why folds form on the forehead and nose with age. The lips are compressed tightly, have a clear pigment. In no case, should they be fleshy. An undershot is characteristic of petit brabankins, a type of bite in which the lower jaw is slightly longer than the upper one. But the teeth close tightly, and the tongue fits completely in the mouth. The chin of the petit brabankin is wide and massive. The eyes of dogs are set wide, round in shape, but not protruding, as, for example, the eyes of the Pekingese. The eye section has a barely noticeable slant. The iris has a rich brown tint, the eyelids fit tightly to the eyeball, and have strong pigmentation. The ears of the petit brabankins are set wide apart and have a triangular shape. The ears are cropped, although this practice has recently been discouraged by breeders. Undocked ears hang down to the muzzle, and cropped ears stand straight and have sharp ends. The body of the petit brabankin is well developed and has a square shape. Strong short neck, thick enough. The length of the body is approximately equal to the height of the dog at the withers. The body is tight, taut and stable. The tail is high and is also docked. In the uncropped state, it is wrapped on its back, but it is usually cut off by two-thirds. Feet are set wide apart, strictly parallel to each other. They have a strong build, slightly rounded, but small in size. The elbows are tightly pressed to the body, the muscles are developed. Popular colors of petite brabankins. The will of the petite brabankins is tough and short in length. The length of the guard hair should not exceed 2 cm, while it remains dense, shiny and smooth. It fits like a shirt and comes in a variety of colors. The variety of colors in this breed is justified by the fact that for centuries the Petit Brabankins interbred with a variety of dog breeds, including mongrels. When purchasing a Petit Brabankin puppy, you can choose from several colors. For example, Petit Brabankins are completely black, and black wool looks very impressive. It is short, tough and shimmers beautifully under the sun. Black color can also be black and tan, in which the Brabankin has characteristic tan marks. These are red spots on the chest, tail, muzzle, and inside of the paws. Similar spots are found in Rottweilers and Dobermans. In Petit Brabankins, they have different colors, the main thing is that they are lighter than the main color of Petit Brabankin. Interesting fact, there is also a deer color of Petit Brabankin. It is a soft creamy shade that is uniform throughout the body. He also has tan marks, but exclusively white, on the chest, paws, tail. The scorch marks on the muzzle are exceptionally darker than on the rest of the body. Petit Brabankins of a red color are often born. They have free standards, so black, black and tan markings in the chin and mustache area are interspersed with a red color. The hair on the face and front of the body is generally much shorter and slightly darker than on the rest of the body. The most rare are chocolate Petit Brabankins. It is an auburn color with a rich golden tint. Chocolate Petit Brabankins are highly prized at exhibitions and auctions. The Nature and Habits of the Petit Brabankins Petit Brabankins are open-minded, cheerful and outgoing dogs. They are always glad to receive people's attention and value it highly. Petit Brabankins quickly get used to their owners and become good companions due to their simple, life-loving nature. Their love of life and playfulness makes them good dogs for children, as the Petit Brabankins love outdoor games. The mimics of the Petit Brabankins are very expressive and how expressive are their emotions. For example, on their faces, joy, sadness, thoughtfulness, and attentiveness are clearly visible. The Petit Brabankins are curious and nimble. They love meeting new people, animals, and even objects. They are carried away by trips and going out into the street, since they perceive the whole world around them with the positive inherent in this breed. Self-esteem is developed in Petit Brabankins. This can be seen in how confident the dog is overlooking new territory, how proudly it behaves with unfamiliar dogs. 
Petit Brabankins are completely non-aggressive, do not conceal resentment, and do not suffer from vindictiveness. At the same time, Petit Brabankins are highly intelligent, well-trained and quickly master educational moments. With their small size, the Petit Brabankins are devoid of fear. The only thing that scares them is loneliness. Petit Brabankins do not tolerate well when the owner is absent from home for a long time, so it is better to take them with you on long trips. Otherwise, the Petit Brabankins, bored by their owners, may refuse to eat and even risk falling into depression. The Petit Brabankins are curious and silent. They rarely bark, like to sleep with the owner, snuggling close to him. The Petit Brabankins are sensitive to the mood of the owner, therefore, when he is sad, they always try to be near. Interesting facts about Petit Brabankins. Petit Brabankins are very attached to the owner. They are very kind and companionable dogs that do not tolerate loneliness. Petit Brabankins are able to highly appreciate the kindness of a person towards them, and they remember well what people treated them positively. Although the Petit Brabankins are completely non-aggressive dogs, they can still stand up for themselves and for the owner. If the dog is mistreated or behaved aggressively towards the owner, then the Petit Brabankin will defend its interests. Petit Brabankins are not vindictive, they are not offended, but they still remember the offender. The attitude towards a person is clearly visible, not only by the movement of the tail, but also by the expression of the muzzle of dogs, they frown when they do not like some person. In addition, all other emotions are clearly visible on dogs. The Petit Brabankins love travel. They should be taken for all active outings, and especially for nature. Petit Brabankins love outdoor activities and run eagerly. For example, they even participate in agility competitions. Petit Brabankins are friendly, so they interact well with other pets at home. In fact, the Petit Brabankins are docile and nice only to the owner. With strangers, they can be capricious and disobedient, especially if the owner left the dog in charge of the guardians while he is away. The Petit Brabankins are even capable of running away from home to find the owner who has left. Due to their natural curiosity, the Petit Brabankins constantly bring various objects found on the streets into the house. It is almost impossible to wean him from this centuries-old instinct speak in the dog when the Petit Brabankins caught rats and mice. Pros and Cons of Petit Brabankins Like any other breed, Petit Brabankins have their positive and negative sides. The positive qualities of these dogs include kindness, incredible friendliness to animals of all kinds, including cats. Also Petit Brabankins treat strangers well. The Petit Brabankins are very much attached to their master and are ready to follow him everywhere. Petit Brabankins are not at all rancorous, they can accept many negative things with a sense of humor. The dog is an excellent family companion. They get along well with children, are ready to play with them often. The Petit Brabankins have high intelligence and good learning ability. They quickly understand the rules of behavior in the house and are well trained. For example, dogs are easy to learn some tricks. The disadvantages of Petit Brabankins include the following facts, Petit Brabankins must not be left to strangers. Leaving home, it is impossible to send the dog for overexposure, leave it to close relatives or friends. Petit Brabankin can refuse to eat, stop moving, lose a lot of weight. Pri Brabankin flatly refuses to listen to strangers. Petit Brabankins are prone to many diseases. Often they are congenital and cannot be treated, which is why Petit Brabankins do not live long. The Petit Brabankins have retained their hunting instincts, so they can sometimes unconsciously chase small prey, be it a squirrel or a bird. It will be difficult to stop a nimble dog. Petit Brabankins are rare and expensive dogs. Caring for the Petit Brabankins. Petit Brabankins are exclusively domestic, warm-loving dogs, so they should never live on the street. Companions should be kept in a city apartment or warm house so that they always have the opportunity to communicate with the family. Petit Brabankins are easy to get used to litter, so even walking several times a day is not required for these dogs. However, you should walk your pet every day. Open air is essential for the normal functioning of the body. The Petit Brabankins are active and need active games and short runs. Communication is also vital for Petit Brabankins, so it is best to drive them to playgrounds with other dogs. Petit Brabankins do not need any special care, you need to comb out their fur every day with a stiff natural bristle brush. The short coat does not need any care. There is also no need to bathe dogs, only if the dog is too dirty. After bathing, it is better to dry the Petit Brabankin with a hairdryer so that it does not catch a cold. An important fact, in winter, it is better not to bathe the dog at all, they are susceptible to the slightest cold. In other cases, wipe the Petit Brabankin with a damp cloth. The ears of the Petit Brabankin should be cleaned once a week. Better to use a 3% hydrogen peroxide solution. They need to moisten a cotton pad or cotton swab. Deep cleaning is prohibited as dogs' ears are sensitive and easily damaged. 
If there are brown crusts on the ears, they give off an unpleasant smell, then the dog should be taken to the veterinarian. Petite Brabankans are great choices about food. While other dogs happily eat natural foods or selected ready-made mixtures, Petite Brabankans eat only what they like. For feeding dogs of this breed use bowls on a high stand. Due to the structure of the muzzle, it is difficult for Petite Brabankans to eat from a low bowl, so the stand should be adjusted so that, as the dog grows, the bowl is always at the level of its withers. Diet is a very important point in feeding a petite Brabankan. Overfeeding these dogs is prohibited as they are prone to obesity. Malnutrition also has a profound effect on the emotional state of this breed. Until six months of age, puppies eat in fractions four to five times a day and then reduce the number of meals to two. Of course, preference should be given to premium food, which is intended for small dogs. Diseases and health problems. The petite Brabankans cannot boast of good health and long life expectancy. There are many risk factors for these dogs. Most of them are improper care, poor feeding and lack of preventive examinations by veterinarians. The first thing to say about the exposure of the petite Brabankans to cold weather. These small dogs catch colds easily and should be dressed warmly when walking during the winter. Including you need to put on special dog boots on your paws. It is forbidden for petite Brabankans to get wet and they should also be protected from all kinds of drafts. Congenital abnormalities of the lips and eyes are common in these dogs. These problems arise from the structural features of the skull. A complete list of diseases that affect the eyes and jaws as follows. Retinal atrophy occurs both by inheritance and as a result of injury. Develops gradually, fraught with blindness, proptosis, in which the eyeballs fall out of the orbits. This problem affects all dogs with flat muzzles and a round skull, most often peckingees. Therefore, the eyelids of the petite probankin should fit snugly against the eyes. Dystichiasis, in which eyelashes grow too close to each other, grow into the skin, interfere with normal vision. Congenital volvulus of the century. Non-falling of milk teeth, in which the molars are already growing. Cleft palate. Narrowing of the nostrils. In addition to this list, petite probankins are susceptible to viruses and various fungal infections. Sometimes they dislocate the patella, so you need to closely monitor the pet's activity. The petite probankins have an extremely difficult birth, and these dogs are also prone to obesity. Petite Brabankin. Price and how to buy it correctly. You can take Petite Brabankin only in the kennel, they guarantee thoroughbred, fully vaccinated dogs without congenital diseases. A Petite Brabankin puppy is an active dog that curiously approaches strangers and wags its tail intensively. Sluggish behavior, lack of interest, and low mobility should put buyers on their guard. The puppy's coat should be shiny and smooth, although there are also wire-haired puppies. There should be no discharge from the eyes and nose. It is also worth checking the inside of the ears to make sure there is no dirt, crusts or an unpleasant odor on it. It is definitely not worth buying a sick petite Brabankin, hoping that you will cure him. Dogs of this breed are difficult to tolerate diseases, so the likelihood of treatment is very small, and you may have to treat the dog for its entire short life. The cost of treatment can even exceed the cost of a puppy that you buy at a discount due to illness. Petite Brabankin puppies should have a bright glossy color. A shiny, brushed coat is a sign of a healthy dog. Puppies are purchased at the age of three months, when they gain independence and are ready for new acquaintances. It is useless to take an adult dog from the hands, the dog will never get used to new owners. Petite Brabankins are expensive. In the shelters, you can buy a pet class puppy 500 US dollars. The most expensive show class puppies cost up to 1500 US dollars. Petite Brabankins with a good pedigree from abroad can cost more than 2000 US dollars. Petite Brabankins is not only a charming expressive face. They are attentive and intelligent dogs that listen to the owner unquestioningly and are always ready to be with him. These dogs feel the mood of loved ones and are happy to provide all possible emotional support. Petit Brabankin is a reliable and benevolent friend who will do his best to please you.